welcome, welcome guys. Thanks for stopping by. My name is Joyce, AKA Hi Nana. That's what my grandkids call me, you guys. It's a long story. <laughs> to sum it all up guys, this is a family channel. It's raw, uncut, and filled with unconditional love. Y'all, this is my handsome husband, g -Pop. I love this man. 25 years of marriage. We have four beautiful daughters and eight awesome grandkids. Come hang with us. Come chill with us. Hanana's life. We're back. <laughs> Not that you guys probably missed us, but we're back. G-Pop and I went out of town for a little bit, but we're back. Happy holidays to everybody. Guys, can you believe Christmas is in like four days? Can you believe this? Four days. You guys, I'm at the car wash trying to get my car cleaned up. You know, it's been raining a lot down here and um, really windy too. Really windy. I don't know what part of town or part of the country you guys stay in, but we're down in Florida and it's been really windy for like the past five days. So yeah, I'm just trying to get the car, a little car wash and um and then i'm headed to target yeah i'm gonna just pick up a few last minute gifts for the grandkids and just see what they got you know last minute shopping i know i'm not the only one out here doing last minute shopping yeah you know guys it's this uh what they call a brushless car wash you know, with just the water, I can't stand that car wash. I cannot stand it. It doesn't get your car clean and it leaves specks all over your car. So yeah, give me the brushes any day. Comment down below if, you know, you like the brushless because you don't want anything touching your car or you want the brushes. But um, yeah, so, I'll, but I'm gonna head to Target and um, I hope you guys are having a good week. I hope you guys are excited about the holidays here. Um, I can't wait till it's over with. I'm ready for 2020 to come, to come in with a positive bang. <laughs> That's what I'm putting out there in the universe, a positive bang, right? So, um, but yeah, I'm gonna finish up here at the car wash, let this uh, machine do what it's gonna do. And guys, I'll just see you when I get to Target, okay? Okay. You guys, I'm in, what am I in? CVS. Um, I've been looking all over. I ran out of my Fit Me Maybelline powder. That's the only thing that I put on my face besides a little bit of um, concealer. So. I'm looking, guys. Y'all, it's so crowded in here. I can't even shop. I'm going to have to call y'all when I get up out of here. This place is crowded, you guys. Crowded. So, I just picked up a few graphic tees. That's it. So, I'm going to pay for it, and then I'm going to get up out of here. Okay, guys? So i check back when I get out of here. Okay. You guys. These folks are crazy out here. They are crazy out here in these streets. So you guys be really careful out there, okay? These people crazy out here. You guys. Y'all. You know, G-Pop and I supposed to be trying to eat right, right? And I said, uh, I didn't cook for Thanksgiving, though. I didn't do that. But my daughter cooked, so... Uh, my other daughters, they went out to dinner and they bought food back, but that's nothing. I said I wasn't cooking for Christmas. I'm trying to eat right so I can get myself in shape, right, for 2020. Hmm. 
Why did I stop and get these? Guys, comment down below if you eat these. Guys, and I done opened them up and started eating them. Now, it was buy one, get one free. So, I think it was like $6. It was like six seventy dollars something and you buy one, get one. Guys, now I'm stuck with two boxes. So I think I'm gonna get my daughter, I'm gonna get my daughter the other one. <laughs> Guys, these people are crazy. Y'all, people crazy. Especially during the holiday season. I don't know if it's the excitement, the adrenaline that people have, but this is crazy. I left um, Target. It was so crowded in Target. I just bought a few things and got up out of there. Um, and then I stopped at Walmart. And that's where the craziness is in Walmart parking lot. So, y'all. G-Pop is running some errands of his own. Um, I think a co-worker of his wanted him to come out to some office that he's trying to set up and help him set up his, uh, his computers over there. So, yeah. G-Pop's good at that. So, you know, he got friends that, you know ask him for help so he doesn't mind it but once he gets home i think we're gonna go out to dinner so um maybe we'll bring you guys with us okay and let you see what we're eating but guys these cookies these cookies guys i'm telling you these cookies y'all comment down below if you just eat them like I do. If you have a small addiction like I do, guys. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. <laughs> My kids said that they remember me buying 10 cans of these cookies and not sharing them. I don't remember that. I'm pretty sure I share with my kids. <laughs> but, um, I'm going to get off, head to the house, and then I'll pick up the camera when G-Pop gets home, and maybe we'll take you out to dinner with us, okay? All right, check back with you. Hey, you guys, what's going on? Yeah, it's a whole nother day. It's the next day. And it's pouring down rain. I think I left off telling you guys. Um, what was I doing? I think I was shopping at Target. And <clears throat> trying to find some stuff. And G-Pop and I were supposed to go out to dinner. We did all that. Guys. It is pouring rain. Let me see if I can let you see. It is nasty out there. It's been raining off and on, guys. Look at the puddles in the road. Look at these puddles. Look at these puddles. It's been raining off and on for like three weeks. Literally about three weeks or longer. But um, how is everybody? How's everybody doing? Y'all, yeah. I don't like this driving and holding this camera. I think I asked you guys last time about a car mount, like uh, a camera mount, a camera mount for my camera. So please let me know if you know any good camera mounts because this hole in the, yeah, the battery died. But um, yeah, a camera mount for my car because I can't do this. I can't drive and, and, and hold this camera. Um, but anyway, um, the seat belt, 
Guys, tell me if you put your seatbelt like this or you put it around your shoulder. I always put the seatbelt in back. I, I don't know. It's just I've been doing that for years and years. I just can't have that around my chest like that. I just can't. But, um, you guys, I'm on my way to Ross. And then I'm... What are you going to do? You trying to come in here? I guess. You guys, I'm on my way to Ross. And, um, come on, you can go. I'm on my way to Ross and then um, to the grocery store um, I'm gonna make some uh, chops not chop steak um, beef stew meat and this comes in squares and chunks you guys know what I'm talking about my husband loves that I saute them up real good uh, season them up real good put onions maybe sometimes pepper and then I'll season them up mix all that together put it in some aluminum foil with a little bit of Worcestershire sauce and I'll wrap them up real good in aluminum foil put them in the oven and my husband loves them just like that um, so yeah I'm gonna make that for dinner and maybe uh, we'll have some baked sweet potatoes and call it a day guys we actually been eating pretty good though we've been eating pretty good so but anyway it's so rainy and nasty out here but I'm on my way to Ross and I guess I'll call you guys when I get there okay yeah I just left out of Ross you guys I cannot stand coming to Ross here it is, the holiday season, and they had two registers open. One person at customer service and another person at the registers. So the person at customer service is helping someone with jewelry, and they're doing returns. Y'all. So... You guys, I'm hungry now. <laughs> so I'm going to find me something to eat really quick. Um, I don't like eating fast food like that or whatever, you know, but I got to get something to eat. So, oh, you guys. Now, you know I shop at Aldi's. I love Aldi's, right? It was hot in there. I love Aldi's. So I bought these, you guys. Can you see them? These are uh, their, this is their version of pita, pita chips. Guys, I don't care how unhealthy they are, how many carbs they got, or whatever. I don't even read the nutrition, nutritional facts because if I read it, it's going to turn me off. So, this is what I bought. And, guys, these things are like crack. This is Parmesan, garlic, and herb. And they're pita chips. And it's a company called Specially Selected. I believe that's Audi's brand. Guys, these things are like crack. Literally. They're delicious. Look at them. Can you see the seasonings and spices and, you know, the Parmesan, the parsley, whatever that is on there. Really, really good. Mmm. I've been on this kick for about a month. Guys, I say it all the time, but these people are crazy out here in these streets. They're crazy. These are delicious, guys. Mm. They're really good. But... I know it's last minute shopping and these guys are rush 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 there's a tar I mean there's a Ross here there's a Macy's down here and <clears throat> I think that's a big lots even big lots is crowded but you know what you can find some good stuff in big lots if you take your time um, and there's a famous footwear back there 
I'm not going over there. I'm about to leave. Um, maybe I'll try to catch them right before they close. Because it's like super crowded up here. And this little parking lot is busy too. But enough with that. Let me go find me some real food. Because I've been eating these chips, like I say, for a little while now. And every time I buy the bag, G-Pop digs in, I dig in, and we eat up the bag in about two days. So, yeah, this is like, literally like my fourth bag. <laughs> so, I'm going to get back, okay, guys? Um... I'll check back with you later, okay? <laughs> so, I made it home. I am done. Turn the oven off. Turn the stove off. Stick a fork in me. Because I'm done. I'm done and I'm home. <laughs> Those streets are crazy out there. You guys, I'm going to start washing and cooking. And I'm coming on to close this video. But, before I do, guys, I want to tell you that I'm thinking about putting some box braids in my hair. Yes, I'm going to do it myself. I've been watching a lot of tutorials, hair tutorials, and you ladies out there, you ladies are fire. You can do some hair. You ladies out there have so much talent that is crazy. So, but I was watching a couple videos and um, the box braid style that they did was the rubber band method. Now, listen, listen, I don't do rubber bands either. The last time I had a rubber band in my hair, I had to have been about 10 years old. I usually wear something like this, like a scrunchy type of elastic band. And that's only if I wear a pony, which is like every now and again. But I'm going to try this rubber band method. The only reason why I want to try this rubber band method is it is it just seems so much neater, you know? Um, so, yeah, I think I'm going to go with that. And I'm going to make them big. I don't like small braids in my hair. I mean, they look beautiful, but the the install and the, and the takedown, oh, no. I don't have the time or the patience. So I'm going to make them big. And when I say big, I'm talking about like, my head is not very big, I don't think. Um, so I think I can go with like 16 to 20 braids. Yes, 16 to 20. So they're going to be pretty big. But um, yes, I'm going to try it, you guys. And I'm going to film the process and I'll bring you along with me while I do it from beginning to end. Yes, I said from beginning to end. I'm going to film it. So wish me luck. So, but yes. This is the end of this video, and I'm going to call it a night. I'm going to get up. I'm going to throw a couple of things in the washing machine, start cooking, and wait for my hubby. So, um, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, guys. Click that notification bell so you won't miss any of my uploads, okay? So, have a good night. Happy holidays, too. How can I forget that? Happy holidays to everybody, to each and every one of you, okay? And have a good night, and I'll see you next time. Peace. This is my life, Hot Nana's life.